Project ALS is something um, I've been involved with for 20 years. Um, a dear friend, Jennifer Estes, was diagnosed with ALS. Um, she was 35 at the time. And before she died, her sisters, Meredith and Valerie, vowed to start Project ALS, which was to find um, enough funding for stem cell research. And in fact, we have our own, it, it's the only stem cell research lab in New York City that um, is privately funded from everything we've raised. Do you feel like you've made any progress in 20 years? We have. We've made progress. And, um, you know, our hope is one day to be able to say in her name, there's a cure. But like everything else, these things take so long. And it's an arduous path. But it's incredibly, um, I'm very humbled by the experience of working with the Estes sisters because it's a fight they're so passionate about. And most people, you know, 20 years is a long time to still be really pioneering this very difficult road. And they're still doing it and making strides. And I find it remarkable that they have that kind of energy and tenacity and willpower to every time they hear no, they say, well, we're looking for a yes, so that won't work.